Welcome back to the channel guys. Today's episode, we're going to look at the Safari Land drop leg holster. Uh, one of the things that I wanted to see if I could figure out a way to make it work was to add some additional mag pouches uh, to it. And Safari Land already has the hole pattern set up. I believe they do have a mag holster available. Um, but the reviews that I read on it, it didn't seem very favorable. Uh, they were made out of some kind of uh, polymer or plastic. And I think one of the issues with it was it uh, eventually tearing or breaking. So I'm a big fan of the S-TAC uh, mag pouches. So I decided to see if I could figure out a way to, to make that work. And what I have on here, as you can see, are the single mag pouches. From behind, you can see they're just held in by the same type of screw that comes with it. I was able to get the screws off of Amazon. I think they're referred to as a Chicago black screw. And I believe they're the 3 8 inch depth for this particular one. So in order to make it work, and I've got a, a dual pouch here just for the sake of the video, but I went ahead and made some 1 8 inch aluminum plates that were also threaded. And essentially you're just going to feed those in. Let's try it again here. It's a little tricky because it is definitely super tight there. Let me try this one. Now one of the holes you'll see is gonna be right at about the split of the molly. The other one is gonna hit about dead center. So you would adjust it however, however you want it in there, but that seemed to work the best. And the best way to cut out the holes was to use a, um, uh, like a soldering iron with a point to it and push into the holes and that would also prevent any fraying because it seals the material. But you want to make it, you know, definitely bigger than the hole itself. So you've got no problems feeding the screw through through the back side of it. And here's a look at the, the screw itself. So once those are done, you would just simply uh, use some uh, thread lock on it, feed it back through screw it in tight, it definitely is not going to go anywhere. It's as, as stable as it would be if it was on your belt, like the ones that I've got on here now. And it just adds, you, you could even use one as a uh, multi-tool holder or just simply um, for magazines. But that's about it, not a whole lot to it, but I thought it may be useful for somebody out there that wants to just have the ability to add some extra magazines to their, their holster. So thanks for tuning in. Uh, remember to like and subscribe. Have a good day.